Domine labia mea peries. Heros meum annunciabit laudem tua. Come, let us worship Christ, who for our sake suffered death and was buried. Come, let us worship Christ, who for our sake suffered death and was buried. Venite exultemus domino, jubilemus Deo salutari nostro. Preocupemus faciem eus in confessione, et in salmis jubilemus ei. Come, let us worship Christ, who for our sake suffered death and was buried. Coniam Deus manius dominus, et rex manius super omnes Deo. Quia in mano eus sunt profunda terre, et altitudines monsium ipsius sunt. Quoniam ipsius est mare et ipse fecit illum, et sicam manus eus forma verus. Then let us worship Christ, who for us sake the fruit died that was buried. Venite adoremus et procidamus, et genua flectamus ante dominum qui fecit nos, quia ipse est eus noster, et nos populus pasque eus, et oves manus eus. Come, let us worship Christ, who for our sake suffered death that was buried. Ut in ham hodie vocem eus audiatis, nullite obdurare corda vestra. Sic ut in meribus secundum diem massa in deserto, ubi tenta verunt me patres vestri, Proba verunt me et si viderunt opera mea. Come, let us worship Christ, who for our sake suffered death that was buried. Quadra ginta anis teduit me generationis ilius, et ixi populus erantium corde sunt isti. Her ipsi non conio verunt vias meas, ideo juravi in ira mea, non intruibunt in requiem mea. Come, let us worship Christ, who for our sake suffered death that was buried. Gloria Patri et Filio, Et Spiritu mi Santo, sicut erat in principio et nunc et semper, et in secula seculorum. Amen. Come, let us worship Christ, who for our sake suffered death and was buried. Redeemer of our fallen race, with contrite hearts we sing to you. Forgive us, Lord, we humbly pray. Forgive us who confess your name. The power of Satan at his source, you broke my death upon the cross. Side on the forehead with his seal, we bear the banner of our faith. His grim dominion over us, you deign to shatter and dispel. Lest he forever should do harm to souls once ransomed by your blood. You visited the gloom of hell. To lead to everlasting joy, the 
faithful of the ancient law, awaiting you in silent tomb. Alone you know the certain time when this our world must pass away. And when as judge of every soul, you will award what justice claims. So heal our wounds, we beg this day, O Savior Jesus Christ our Lord, who with the Father will be praised forever with your spirit's love. Amen. In peace I will lie down and sleep. When I call, answer me, O God of justice. From anguish you release me, have mercy and hear me. So men, how long will your hearts be closed? Will you love what is futile and seek what is full? It is the Lord who grants favors to those whom he loves. The Lord hears me whenever I call him. Fear him, do not sin. Ponder on your bed and be still. Make justice your sacrifice and trust in the Lord. What can bring us happiness, many say. Let the light of your face shine on us, O Lord. You have put into my heart a greater joy than they have from abundance of corn and new wine. I will lie down in peace and sleep comes at once. For you alone, Lord, make me dwell in safety. Glory to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now and will be forever. Amen. In peace. I will lie down and sleep. My body shall rest in hope. Preserve me, God, I take refuge in you. I say to the Lord, you are my God. My happiness lies in you alone. He has put into my heart a marvelous love. For the faithful ones who dwell in his land, those who choose other gods increase their sorrow. Never will I offer their offerings of blood. Never will I take their name upon my lips. O Lord, it is you who are my portion and cup. It is you yourself who are my pride. The lot marked out for me is my delight. Welcome indeed the heritage that falls to me. I will bless the Lord who gives me counsel, who even at night directs my heart. I keep the Lord ever in my sight. Since he is at my right hand, I shall stand firm. And so my heart rejoices, my soul is glad. And when my body shall rest in safety. For you will not leave my soul among the dead, nor let your beloved know decay. You will show me the path of life the fullness of joy in your presence, at your right hand happiness forever. Glory to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now and will be forever. Amen. 
my body shall rest in hope. Lift high the ancient portals, the King of glory enters. The Lord's is the earth and its fullness, the world and all its peoples. It is the host that did on the sea, on the water she made it firm. Who shall climb the mountain of the Lord? Who shall stand in his holy place? The man with clean hands and pure heart, who desires not worthless thing, who has not sworn so as to deceive his neighbor. He shall receive blessings from the Lord and reward from the God who saves him. Such are the men who seek him, seek the face of the God of Jacob. O gates, lift high your heads, grow higher ancient doors, let him enter the King of glory. Who is the King of glory? The Lord, the mighty, the valiant, the Lord, the valiant in war. O gates, lift high your heads, grow higher ancient doors, let him enter the King of glory. Who is it, the King of glory? Hit the Lord of armies. He is the King of glory. Glory to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now and will be forever. Amen. Lift high the ancient portals the King of glory enters. Take up my cause and rescue me. Be true to your word, give me life. Misericordia Domini, quia non somos consumti, quia non defecerunt miserationes eius. No fidi luculo, multa es fides tua. Hed. Pars mea dominus, dixit anima mea, propterea expectabo eum. Tet, bonus est dominus per antibus in eum, anime querenti ilum. Tet, bonum est prestulari, Cum silencio salutare Dei. Tet. Bonum est viro cum porta veritugum. Abadolescencia sua. Io. Say, 
debit solitarius set acebit, qui aleva vit super se. Iod, ponet in pulvere osum, si fortes it spes. Iod, dabit percusientis e maxilam, Satura bituro propris. Jerusalem, Jerusalem, God vertere ad dominum deum tu. After the Lord was laid in the sepulcher, the tomb was sealed. A stone was rolled to the entrance of the tomb. Then soldiers were set to guard him. The chief priests approached Pilate with their petition. Then soldiers were set to guard him. as color of timus. Dispersi sunt lapides sanctuari, in capite omnium platearum. Et Filii et amicti hauro primo, quo modo reputati sunt in basat est Dea, opus manum figoli. Sed et lamie nuda verunt mama, lacta verunt catulos suos. Tilia populi mei crudelis, quasi srutz dio in deserto. Talet Ade sit lingua lactentis A palatum eius institi Parvuli pessi erunt panem Et non era qui frangere tei Qui vesciat pantur voluptuose, in terii erunt in vis. Qui nutriebantur unc in croceis, 
Amplexati sum cercora. Au. Et maior effecta est, iniquitas filiae populi mei, peccato sodomorum. Resu versa est in momento, et non ce perunt in mea manu. Jerusalem, Jerusalem, convertere ad dominum Deum tu. Arise, Jerusalem, and take off the trappings of joy. Put on sackcloth and ashes. Israel been slain. Let your tears flow like a torrent day and night. Let there be no repose for your eyes. For in you has the Savior of Israel been slain. Recordare Domine, qui acciderit nobis, intuere et respice opprobrium nostrum. Hereditas nostra, versa est ad alienos, domus nostre ad extraneos. Who pili facti sumus absque patre, mates nostre quasi vidue, aquam nostram pecunia bibimus, linia nostra preziho comparavimus. Cervicibus nostris minabamu, lasis non dabature quies. Egipto derimus manum et asiris, ut satura remor panhe. Patres nostri peccaverunt et non sunt, et nos iniquitates eorum portavimus. Servitominati sunt nostri, non fuit qui redimeret, de manu eorum. In animabus nostris aferebamus panem nobis, a facie gladii in deserto. Pelis nostra quasi clinabus, Exusta est facie, tempestatum famis. Muli heres in Sion, humili averunt, 
Et virgines in civitatibus, Jerusalem, Jerusalem, convertere a dominum Deum tu. Lament like a virgin, my people. Howl, you shepherds, in sackcloth and ashes. For the day of the Lord has come, a day exceedingly bitter. Gird yourselves, O priests, and weep, O ministers of the altar. Sprinkle yourselves with ashes. I sat daily with you in the temple teaching, and you did not lay hands on me. And now when you have cursed me, you lead me away to be crucified. A reading from an ancient homily on Holy Saturday. Something strange is happening. There is a great silence on earth today a great silence and stillness. The whole earth keeps silence because the king is asleep. The earth trembled and is still because God has fallen asleep in the flesh, and he has raised up all who have slept ever since the world began. God has died in the flesh, and hell trembles with fear. He has gone to search for our first parents, as for a lost sheep. Greatly desiring to visit those who live in darkness and in the shadow of death, he has gone to free from sorrow the captives Adam and Eve, he who is both God and the son of Eve. The Lord approached them bearing the cross, the weapon that had won him the victory. At the sight of him, Adam, the first man he had created, struck his breast in terror and cried out to everyone, My Lord be with you all. Christ answered him, And with your spirit. He took him by the hand and raised him up, saying, Awake, O sleeper, and rise from the dead, and Christ will give you light. I am your God, who for your sake have become your Son. Out of love for you and for your descendants, I now, by my own authority, command all who are held in bondage to come forth, all who are in darkness to be enlightened, all who are sleeping to arise. I order you, O sleeper, to awake. I did not create you to be a prisoner of in hell. Rise from the dead, for I am the life of the dead. Rise up, work of my hands. You who are created in my image, rise. Let us leave this place, for you are in me and I am in you. Together we form only one person, and we cannot be separated. For your sake, I, your God, became your son. I, the Lord, took the form of a slave. I, whose home is above the heavens, descended to the earth and beneath the earth. For your sake, for the sake of man, I became like a man without help, free among the dead. For the sake of you who left the garden, I was betrayed to the Jews in a garden and I was crucified in a garden. See on my face the spittle I received in order to restore to you the life I once to breathe into you. See there the marks of the blows I received 
in order to refashion your warped nature in my image. On my back see the marks of the scourging I endure to remove the burden of sin that weighs upon your back. See my hands nailed firmly to a tree. For you who once wickedly stretched out your hand to a tree. I slept on the cross and a sword pierced my side for you who slept in paradise and brought forth Eve from your side. My side has healed the pain in yours. My sleep will rouse you from your sleep in hell. The sword that pierced me has sheathed the sword that was turned against you. Rise, let us leave this place. The enemy led you out of the earthly paradise. I will now restore you to that paradise. I will not restore you to that paradise, but I will enthrone you in heaven. I forbade you the tree that was only a symbol of life, but see, I am I who am life itself, and now one with you. I appointed cherubim to guard you as slaves are guarded, but now I make them worship you as God. The throne formed by cherubim awaits you. It bears swift and e its bearers swift and eager. The bridal chamber is adorned. The banquet is ready. The eternal dwelling places are prepared. The treasure houses of all good things lie open. The kingdom of heaven has pre been prepared for you from all eternity. Our shepherd, the source of the water of life, has died. The sun was darkened when he passed away, but now man's captor is made captive. This is the day when our Savior broke through the gates of death. He has destroyed the barricades of hell, overthrown the sovereignty of the devil. This is the day when our Savior broke through the gates of death. Though sinless the Lord has been put to death, the world is in mourning as for an only Son. Hear my voice, O God, as I complain. Guard my life from dread of the foe. Hide me from the band of the wicked, from the throng of those who do evil. They sharpen their tongues like swords, they aim bitter words like arrows. To shoot at the innocent from ambush, shooting suddenly and recklessly. They scheme their evil course. They conspire to lay secret snares. They say, who will see him? Who can search out our crime? He will search who searches the mind and knows the depth of the heart. God has shot them with his arrow and dealt them sudden wounds. Their own tongue has brought them to ruin, and all who see them mock. Then will all men fear, they will tell what God has done. They will understand God's deeds, the just will rejoice in the Lord. Then fly to him for refuge. All the upright hearts will glory. Glory to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit. 
as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. Though sinless the Lord has been put to death, the world is in mourning as for an only son. From the jaws of hell, Lord, rescue my soul. Once I said in the noontime of life, I must depart. Till the case of the nether world I shall be consigned for the rest of my years. I said I shall see the Lord no more in the land of the living. No longer shall I behold my fellow men among those who dwell in the world. Thy dwelling like a shepherd's tent is struck down and borne away from me. You have thrown it up my life like a weaver who severs the last thread. Day and night you give me over to torment. I cry out until the dawn. Like a lion, you break sore my bones. Day and night, you give me over to torment. Like a swallow, I utter shrill cries. I moan like a dove. My eyes grow weak, gazing heavenward. O Lord, I am in stress, be my surety. You have preserved my life from the pit of destruction. When you cast me hide your back in all my sin. For it is not the netherworld that gives you thanks, nor death that praises you. Neither do those who go down into the pit Await your kindness. The living, the living give you thanks, as I do today. Father, declare to the Son, O God, your faithfulness. The Lord is our Savior. We shall sing to stringed instruments. In the house of the Lord, all the days of our life. Glory to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now and will be forever. Amen. From the jaws of hell, Lord, rescue my soul. I was dead, but now I live forever, and I hold the keys of death and of hell. Praise God in his holy place. Praise him in his mighty heavens. Praise him for his wonderful deeds. Praise his surpassing greatness. Who oh, praise him with sound of trumpets. Praise him with lute and harp. Praise him with timbrel and den. Praise him with strings and pine. Who oh, praise him with resounding cymbals. Praise him with clashing of cymbals. Let everything that lives and that breathes give praise to the Lord. Glory to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now and will be forever. Amen. I was dead, but now I live forever, 
and I hold the keys of death and of hell. Thus says the Lord, in their affliction they shall look for me. Come, let us return to the Lord, for it is he who has rent, but he will heal us. He has struck us, but he will bind our wounds. He will revive us after two days. On the third day, he will raise us up to live in his presence. For our sake, Christ was obedient, accepting even death, death on a cross. Therefore, Therefore God, God raised him on high and gave him the name above all other men. Save us, O Savior of the world. On the cross, you redeemed us by the shedding of your blood. We cry out for your help, O God. Benedictus Dominus Deus Israel, quia visitavit et fecit redemptionem plebis suve. Et rex et conus salutes nobin, in the modavit power is so e. Secut locus ut espero sanctorum, quia seculos un profetarum eius. Salutem es nene mutis nostri, edem manu omnium quio derut non. Ad faciendo misericordiam cum patribus nostris, et memorari testamenti sui sancti. Ia surrendum cotura vitat Abraham patrem nostrum, saturum se nobing. Ut sin e timore de manu inimicorum nostrorum liberati, serviamus ili. In sanctitate et sessia cora mezzo, omnibus diebus nostri. Et tu puer profeta altissimi vocaberi, Prehibis enim ante faciem domini parare via seius. Et dendem sien sien salutis plebi eium, in remissionem peccatorum eorum. Per viscera misericordiae Dei nostri, in quibus visitavit nos oriens exalto. Illumina rehis qui in tenebris ed in umbra mortis sedem, et diritendo speris nostros in viam paci. Gloria Patri et Filio et Spiritui Sancto, Secuterat in principio et nunc esemper, et in secula seculorum. Amen. Save us, O Savior of the world. On the cross you redeemed us by the shedding of your blood. We cry out for your help, O God.
this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us and lead us not into temptation but deliver us from evil all powerful and ever living God your only son went down among the dead and rose again in glory in your goodness, raise up your faithful people, buried with him in baptism, to be one with him in the eternal life of heaven, where he lives and reigns with you and the Holy Spirit, God forever and ever. Amen. 